Sarah, we have to go. Are you listening? Now, Clementine! If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. Look, Sarah. Bitch. I'll leave you sad, like... Nah! Don't come at me now! Nah! Don't come at me now! No, no. And welcome to another Mr. Cabin Fever video. We are coming at you today with what is this game called? Uh, The Walking Dead. We are coming at you with. Episode four. Hey, if you guys been following this, make sure you tune in. You know, we're gonna follow our journey as Clementine the G Gangster. You know, leave a like, share, subscribe, comment, do anything, show this channel some love. But without further ado, let's get this game going. Previously on The Walking Dead, I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. Now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. <laughs> Fucker. No! No! Stop me! Kenny! Kenny! When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Go on. You don't need to see this. I'm not going anywhere. Games presents Come. in association with Scott Valley Entertainment, no. The Walking Dead, the dead that are walking, no. but not zombies. Oh, Kenny, you just can't have nobody. She's been nice to me, so I'll be nice to her. Oh gosh, Serena! Kenny can't have nobody for himself. She's gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. We'll come. We have to move. Better get one last nut off, boy. Before she die. Maybe 
I don't know. I don't. I don't. Thank God. I can't find anybody. I know. What do we do? Luke was with me, but we can't stay here with that. We need to keep moving. <laughs> I hate her. We'll have to push through that cluster of walkers. There's so many. We'll make a cow catch up. Just all we need. Okay, just tell me what to do. There. That one looks like it's scary. I'm gonna get on the far side of her. I need you to get her attention. Super cool. I know everything. Head ass. I can cut a walker's jaw off. Amid the ruins. Where's Kitty? <laughs> what they have baths, Lava? Is everything all right? No, I'm not all right. But I'll be a lot better once we get with the others. We need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? That baby coming, boy. That baby coming. If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. Sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? We'll watch out for each other. So long as we keep up a good pace. I know, I know. Just, I'm going as fast as I can. Like my candle. I know I should feel glad that we escaped. 
But I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If the plan worked, we got out of there. Most of us. Look, I know that some of your people didn't make it, but Carver was crazy. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course! We panicked! We were scared! The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No! No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. Ugh. I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Vaughn! Vaughn, 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 Vaughn! Take a minute. Thank you. Vaughn, 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 Vaughn! Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Rebecca, are you going to be okay? Now you're a single mother. Yeah, Vaughn, I'm gonna have to punish you. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and, you know, other stuff. Guys, that baby is coming, like it or not. Fine. And then what? It's going to be helpless, and you can't protect it. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... What? She died? Is this, uh, what's her name, I sister? I don't need your pity. Oh man, the girl with the she hook. What was her name? Molly? You don't have the right. Jane! <laughs> Shit, I didn't mean it. Jane, wait. <sighs> Damn this is Molly's sister, the one that that they were he was she was like fucking for medicine. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit! It had been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would be here. Oh, besides, where's everyone else? We were hoping you would know. This memorial works fine as a meeting spot. No way we can stay here long term. I told you. That's why we're waiting. And as soon as everyone else gets here, we'll figure something out. You wanted to leave without us? What? No. I wanted to go out and try to find everyone. Well, what does Kenny want to do? I tried to talk to Kenny. He flipped out on me. He started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. Ain't nothing scary about Kenny. Scary. Sarita's on her way out. She's probably gonna turn soon. Is, uh, is he gonna take care of her? Jane! I know it's not pretty, but it's better than the alternative. It's not our decision to make. But it's the one that's gotta be made. We're already up the creek enough without a walker to worry about. Just let me talk to him first. It's all right, Sarita. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna be here with you. Right till the end. Hi, Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? I said we just wanted a little fucking time alone to say goodbye. <coughs> shh, shh, shh. It's okay, babe. It's okay. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna do what we gotta do. Gonna play the shit hand that this shit world dealt us. Kenny, I'm so sorry about Sarita. You hear that, babe? Clem says she's sorry. Don't that make you feel better? Why are you 
acting this way. Take one wild guess, Clementine. I tried to save look her. At her. I said, look at her. Uh, I'm tired of Kenny, bro. She is going to die because of you. Because of me. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works! Alright, I'm done with bro. Now for the last time, just leave us alone to say goodbye. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Fuck, dude. Kenny's being a jerk. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That's like, can't get over it, like, bro. What's going through? Like, you just keep. At least you try. Still, doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. Nah, we got no nah, food, fuck Kenny. Water is getting damn cold. And we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. My dark Kenny would have a plan. Mike. Pony. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands, too. What? Suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? We should go find Luke, Sarah, and Nick. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Yeah, like, Clementine. Kenny a jerk, bro. He's weird. After all this. If there's any chance they're still alive, you need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Thank you. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to? I don't know. But you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. Come on, Clem, Clem. Clem, 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 Clem. Clementine! The OG Clem! Kenny, I don't care what you like when you get mad, bro. Sometimes when you get mad and you say things, you gotta stand on what you say. And I'm about sick and tired of brothers being mad and saying shit. Like, no. Look, I'm gonna level with you. You should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart, but I still... I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before. And, well, a lot of times, it's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start... You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. But your odds are better. There's nobody to watch your back. And when something does happen, there's nobody there to help you. How much help is Kenny going to be? What he's going through? He's more of a liability than anything. I real up. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're going to get are broken decisions. How can you get along without trusting anyone? That's exactly how I. I'm not signing with Kenny no more at this point, Bobby. Sure, I'm tired of signing with Kenny. I like Kenny. most of the people in your crew. What's true, but Jeff? Groups fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it, if you wanna. Like your jacket. It looks warm, but a walker will bite right through that. My sister Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You could've. Yeah, no. Kenny's definitely a liability. He let his emotions act too wild. What 
What happened to your sister? <laughs> Seems we always want to talk about the end, don't we? You know, being a big sister is, well, it's funny. Oh boy. It's really easy to be mean. Oh? You know, hide her toys, make fun of her bad haircut, give her the bad haircut on purpose. I mean, I did. Your haircut ain't no better. I figured I should get it out. I don't even know why. Is that really what it's like having a sister? No, no. It's not all bad, but. What could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I couldn't. At this point, I don't trust Kenny, so I trust Jane more. I trust a random man in the woods more than Kenny. Every summer we'd go to this amusement. Dude just snapped too much. But the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there, and I'd, I'd pretend we weren't sisters, just friends. <clears throat> Jackpot. Bet these walkers got some good stuff. Don't get bit. Oh, okay. Mark. They're just walkers. Why would they have anything? Well, pretty recently they weren't walkers, were they? Take a look. Old walkers are a waste of time. They're holding credit cards and busted old pagers. But these ones weren't walkers all that long ago. They were survivors. They might have useful stuff. That one's not coming back. Let's see what else he's got. I'll check this one. Two bullets. Hold on to him. Ammo's getting hard to come by, and things aren't going to get better. Find anything? Driver's licenses. Two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. I don't think so. I think you 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 just saying stuff at this point, Bondi. Smart haircut. Thanks. So, has your crew always been so dysfunctional? I don't even know these people. You fit in there, but you weren't like them. It makes me wonder. I've actually only been with them a little while. I don't know what it was like. No, she did. She never said, "Oh, I will just kill you." But Penny was different. I know that. That's it. A nail file. These things are great. Sharpen a blade, strike a flint. Jamie always had one in her purse. I jabbed my hand when I went reaching in. Never be too sure with these things. Here, give me a hand. These glasses, they're Sarah's. Looks like your friend didn't make it. Sorry. All we know is that she was here. It could be a good sign. Don't go getting your hopes up. Look, Clem, I know what you want me to say, but... Yeah! Sarah! Goddamn! Shit! Okay, come on. We gotta find a way in. Looks like there's an opening over there. Sarah's alive? Oh, this is the one dude? That shot the other dude? It's Nick. Yeah, it is, huh? Look, he's your friend. You should do this. She said she don't trust no one. But I, I never heard her say she's gonna kill the pregnant lady. Never heard her say that, Vonda.
I didn't hear that body. <laughs> Anybody needs to be put down. You gotta be ready for it. No hesitation. You know I'll go back right? and check it. It never gets any easier, does it? As in for me. That hatchet of yours seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. A screwdriver. Very effective. We can do this. Sound too good. Clock is ticking. Okay, we're in. What now? Start by getting a better look. What are we looking for? How about you get the close one and I'll have the fence to get the other? Go for it. He's nice. He just run up on him like that. Nice. Nice work. You know what you're doing. Now watch this. Got a nice little addition to your arsenal. <laughs> Pick out the knees first. Then put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. All right. But Let's she actually cares. On deck. I like her. It's gonna take some work to get over there. Glad you're paying attention. Yeah, most of these guys are gonna have nothing on them. But it's worth taking a look when it's not too risky. Let's go. Go. Let's <laughs> just run up on them. Like... You did the knee thing. Nice trick, huh? You should teach me stuff. I know how to work. That's a lot of walkers. They look worked up about something. And what gets the interest of the dead? People. How do we get in? If we make can some make noise. enough noise on this side, we can lure those walkers over here. Then we might just be able to go through that other trailer and get to your friends. What do you think of that? If you think that's best, I'm with you. Good. What's going to grab their attention? Noise. I got you covered. No, no, no. Come on. <laughs> oh, maybe I can make like um noise to cut, like beat the horn or something. Something else to do. Why are you stop moving? What can I do, Phil? Maybe I can find a key. <laughs> or maybe he got a key. Come 
What are you thinking? If we lean him on the horn, it'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Just like moths to a flame. Give me a hand. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, boy, you have it! Lay off the grits! It's working! Come on! Man, I'm surprised that car still got some battery. Behind you, Clem! <laughs> oh, we got a Louis Vuitton! We are gonna die in here. Crap, we gotta move it! Try something else. What am I gonna tell? You're gonna need to use more force than that. Put some muscle into it. I'll hold them off. Just get us in there. Hurry! FBI! Open up! <laughs> Damn, why did you push me? This is just. Oh! Help me block this! Hurry! Sarah, please! Who's out there? Luke! Clem? Oh, thank God. Didn't Nick find you? He made a run for it. Looking for help. I... I saw him outside. Look, he was out there. But we took care of him. You know? Fuck. Fuck. When I heard y'all banging through the door. Luke, where's Sarah? I... I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? It. You gotta help. Did she... did she turn? See, uh. look. Look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you. That they're okay. And I got your glasses. Sarah, come on. We... we have to go now. Was she bitten? Did they get her? No, she ain't bit. She's just yeah. a baby. I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. I don't know. It's just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then while she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. We're not out of the woods yet. What are we gonna do about her? Let her die, fuck. We gotta do something. Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I uh in real life she did in my eyes. Place open pretty soon. We can't stay. So we, we gotta get her up or, or we gotta Leave her. Well, I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I can barely get her to look at me. Clown? Just lick her pussy a little bit. She she get up. Come on, Clem. Sarah, get gay for her. It's me. Fuck this bitch! No! <laughs> Fuck her! Shit. Bro, fuck this bitch! Maybe it seems like you're all alone right now, but you're not. Yes, I am. What about Luke? Okay, you're alone. Bye, bitch. Damn. I'm here because of you. All of us in the group. <laughs> We're your family now. Close the curtains. What? What about the skylight? Oh, we got. Clem, there's no time. Clem, we can't be kids anymore, Sarah. You need to grow up, or you'll die. There aren't any other choices. Get to the skylight! Now! Come on, I'll boost you! 
You useless ass there. bastard. My ribs. We're gonna need something to stay. The fridge. Forget it. That thing ain't budging. Find something else. Can we use this? It's not big enough. Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What? Three. One, two, three. All right, yeah, get these people up out of here, Bondi. Well, I would just throw Sarah out there. Like, hey, go out there and say how to go, people. Clem, Clem, help her. Help Jane. Oh, what am I doing? Okay, go, go, get. Keep pushing. Go. Jane! Do not die, Jane. I like you. Luke, you first. We need you up top. <laughs> Sarah, we have to go. Are you listening? Now, Clementine! If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down too. Not again. Fuck Sarah. Bitch. I'll leave you sad, like. Clementine. Ah! Don't Clementine me now! No, 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 Clementine. Nah. Don't Clementine me now. No, no. No, no, no. Have a choice. No. Okay, there's nothing we can do. There's no. There's nothing we can do. Nope. Man, hey, for real, Bonnie? Nope. She talking about Clementine? Nah, bitch. Nah. <laughs> for real, bro. Talk about some Clementine. Now you got some sense when you about to die. Get out of here. Ain't got one lick of sense until you about to die. I ain't on you, Sarah. That's slow. That was not. I was not sad about that. Sometimes I, I feel for these people in this game, Jay. Think you'd leave her. But no, Sarah was fucking tripping, bro. We didn't have a choice. She wouldn't have come with us. It may be hard to hear, but you weren't going to be able to save her. She was never going to make it in this world. Man, right! Am I about to baby her? Yeah, I guess. I guess there was just nothing we could do. I was saying, baby, hey, hey, my daughter, fuck, fuck, her. fuck her. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just, I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. Does that mean you'd turn on me if I was hurt or something? No. I mean... Clem. I wouldn't have to. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she... gave up. And when you really look at it, maybe it's better this way. For everyone. The weak people die. Is that what you mean? It's better we were there for that the weak people die. You know, I should have gotten through to him. I should have done <laughs> something. Luke, shut the hell up. Was leave her behind. <sighs> Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Whoop, now you mad about it. You was ready to leave her too. I, forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her, or push her, or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... I knew Sarah was weird. ...forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I... ...couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw... So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. 
and I left her there. Damn, you cold blooded. To the next building over by myself. You left your sister? How could you leave your sister? I don't. I don't know. I'll leave my brother. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell when all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah wasn't Jamie. She wanted to make it. She just couldn't. That's her father's maybe, fault for real. She didn't really want it. It was Sarah's dad's fault on, for real. Let's get back to your friends. He was babying her. Like she didn't teach her the real world now. Like I understand wanting your child to be a child, but you can't just do that in this kind of world. Son of a bitch. You found him. Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Wait, where's Sarah? They're dead. And Nick? Nick dead too. Uh, Rebecca, how about we uh we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. No. No. Why? What? No. I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know. Does Luke know anything about babies? Oh. Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? No, I don't think so. I was afraid of that. I don't know anything. Mike sure as hell doesn't. I don't even know how to ask Jane. And that just leaves... Kenny. Kenny. He brought Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. I've seen him like this before. That's why I was thinking you could talk to him. I think if it's just you, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through to him. And I wouldn't ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. I know. I was only even like Kenny at this point. We need your help with Rebecca's baby. No one else knows what to do. She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. That beautiful face. So I waited. I thought maybe she'd be different. I'm sorry, Kenny. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katya. Sarita. No peace. No rest. Punches just keep coming. I'll feel something, bro. Why the hell could Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That's not true. You help me all the time. I need you. <sighs> I've seen you take care of yourself more than any three adults put together. 
But, uh, thanks for saying that. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Maybe one of the others can look at it for you. Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? Her water broke. We should see what's going on. Sarita! Dead, mommy! Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. I don't That's think Kenny did. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. And that means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. It hurts more than before. Is something wrong? What should we do first, Kenny? Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing. And blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay. <laughs> Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Clem. Yo, my I know dude. it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? Let her go, You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. She's helped us so far. Yeah, no, you're right. Maybe it's- Why do you care if she leave? Let her leave, shit! Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. Maybe I should go with Jane. <sighs> Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. Oh, hey. Be rap from Malibu. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. It's just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Man, super terrible haircuts, J J J J J J J J J Studio Gaming. J J J J J Studio. You know, J Studio Studio Gaming. Okay, huh? Well, yeah, but who is okay? Let's just focus on this right now. Ooh, hair loose. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we can break. hurt my head. Check this out. 
Best gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. The cannonball in here? You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. Oh. They fill them with cement so they're safe. It's broken. <laughs> Find anything? No, not even trash. Can't go in here. All right, what am I looking for? There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Is this Sarah? Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. Oh, it's not Sarah. And who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around, so... Can we fight him? Could be too risky. I didn't get a good look at him. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. He I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. We should just try and stay out of sight till he's gone. Good call. Shit. Hide now. That man got a wood, I mean a wood and a metal leg. To shoot. Hello, I'm Jane. I don't want to shoot anyone, especially my uh, little little girl. Jane, he has a gun. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. <laughs> Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. What is it? A zombie head? No, I have no more uh. guns. I swear to you. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry and that makes those things come. Please. If that medicine's for your sister, why are you hiding it in the garbage? I, uh, I need to keep it, I need to keep it safe. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. 
You have already left me defenseless, and now you you take my sister's medicine. You shouldn't pull a gun. Hey, what should I do, y'all? Hey, okay, we've got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. What should I do, Vondi? What should I do, J Studio? We're still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it, Clementine. We need people that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special, Clementine. Oh, I gotta pause it. What should I do, y'all? <laughs> You must we believe. don't believe a fucking word about your six. I'm sorry, Arvo. We need these. You feel fish? You could have done this. See? Did he go threaten? <laughs> no, what are you doing? You didn't have to do this. Jane, what are you doing? Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. I wouldn't even let him go. I probably would have killed his ass. They gonna bring his people back. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Taking some stupid kid's stuff. Like a bandit. We should go get everyone else. Yeah. Go bring those meds to the others and bring everybody back here. I'm gonna get this place open. Now we need to get moved in. Asa. Right, though, Vani! <laughs> now she's having Stiller's remorse. Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation deck? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop and a stranger showed up. He had a lot of medicine, so we took some. We what? took all of it. You robbed him? Yes. Seriously? You stole meds from somebody? Sometimes you have to do bad things if you want to survive. Where is this guy now? Jane took his gun and chased him off. Well, I guess Jane's really rubbed off on you. Is oh, Jane up there now? Yeah, she's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm still not sure what to think about her. She's strong, and she's been helping us, but she's cold. Maybe. Nobody's that cold. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to branch out. What do you mean? Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Man, everybody blame, like, Clem for everything. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. But I just think he's had to take more than he can handle. Yeah, nah, he's yeah. broken. He always tries to do the right thing, but he's not the same anymore. I'm glad you see it too. Yeah, I, I see it. Kenny tripping. Kenny be on bullshit. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. I'm tired of getting cussed out about Kenny, man. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. <laughs> Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you. You're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. <laughs> Glad I you agree. made it back safe. How are you feeling? 
scared and it hurts. <laughs> yeah. I wish Alvin was here. Fuck Alvin and his chipmunks. <laughs> Alvin would be really proud of you right now. You think so? I know oh, so. Right. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things Maybe I should you should have cheated. About. Maybe you shouldn't have cheated. You know? How am I ever going to do this without him? We'll all help you keep the baby safe. <laughs> oh, yeah? You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Damn, you just know, you know I'm about to be a uh, baby daddy? Damn. So I ain't gonna be. I gonna be there. We ain't seen Take care of my baby for me. And I'm not saying I don't trust him, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on him. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. They about to be in this um uh, woods fucking. She'd take off. Yeah, she's trying to get the place we found ready for Rebecca. Well, that's good. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty-handed. But I just want to help. Well, that boy ear got bitten, bro. We worry about the wrong Keep stuff. Keep on the woods while we're in here. Hey, look at this—an old coat. Nice, good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Do you want it? That's real sweet of you, Clan, but you should probably hang on to it for Rebecca. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think Oh yeah, I'm gonna definitely say that R will do it again. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. You finally opened your eyes about Carver and what a bad person he was. That's something. Yeah. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh, we can't put Rebecca in a confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. <laughs> this is better than nothing, though. Man, she gonna tell you what the fuck she can get at this point. Over here. Water. Water! Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Michael nah, really? Out. Might be a bit heavy for you. My leg! I'm stuck. Okay, maybe I push from... Oh! <laughs> Damn! That was like your ear bitten down, boy. He manhandled that thing. Well, that happened. <sighs> Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Guess I'm not quite as small as I used to be. But you're tough for your size. Shit. You're tough for my size. I'm sorry I asked you. I won't do it again. It's cool, Bonnie. Relax. We good. At least now we got something to bring back. Keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Well, throw her back out. 
Then Bonnie to do it. She a whole grown ass woman. Wait, now let's ask the kid to do it. I got this. You're so strong, Mike. That looks pretty heavy. Ah, uh, it's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Cargo was crazy, but at least his shells were always full. We'll make a plan. Everyone will have enough. I hope so. Oops. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stick close. I just walked on in like I'd owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I need the shit out of that raccoon. I'm weak. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! <laughs> Where is it? I think it went over there. Over here! Shoot it. Not with the walkers out there. I still would have shot it, fuck. I'm even hungrier than I was before. Fuck you and your babies. How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well, at least it was kind of fun. Yeah. Huh. I guess it was. Come on. Let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. <laughs> we don't have much time to wait. That is how they beat OJ Studio. <laughs> Clem, shoot the raccoon! I'm like, bro, what? You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. <laughs> I could do this all day. No! No! Shit, shit. Oh, God. Breathe no! like I told you. Okay, 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 okay. Oh yeah, you screaming, bringing all the damn walkers. Oh God. Oh. Shit, walkers. How'd they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. Clementine, where's the place you and Jane found? I'll show you. Good. Someone help me out. Mike, the water! On it! Jesus. You ain't got it like you used to, Kenny. He's okay. He's losing it. I mean, that... That isn't... He's doing it to protect us. Sure. Kenny! Oh, you got one water? What the other one? Damn it! You missing a water. Oh, that is up here fucking? Jesus, Clem, it's just not. Uh, What's going on? Well, uh, I mean. In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. The walkers are right behind us. We have to keep them from getting up here. There's still the stairs. No! Uh. I'm sorry. Shit. Right over Shit. here. I was up here smacking. Oh, God. Oh, God. There you go. Just oh. rat it out. Oh. I have pills. I think they'll help with the pain. 
What are they? Looks like Oxy. I want them. Wait, wait, is that okay for a pregnant lady? Give me the fucking pills! Okay. They're coming up the stairs! Here, we should... You want to help? Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs! Shoot them before they get to us! Shit, that's a lot of them. We need everyone out here! What do I do? Whatever you can, Clay. I'm going outside. I'll help hold them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come! Here. We can't let them up here. thing over here. Here, roll this thing over here. Give it time to fuck, Jane. Fuck, hurry! I can't hold on! Take my hand! Push! Oh, shit. They're climbing up. What? They're gonna make it up here. Fuck! Does this shit ever end? Can we drop something else on them? Nothing that will stop them. Maybe we can drop the whole deck. She's right. She's right. Drop the whole deck. Drop the... Are you fucking crazy? How are we gonna do that? I don't know. Just look around. <laughs> Ain't gonna work. It's too thick. Black babies don't come out that dark. Fuck out of here. <laughs> AJ. So look at the Alvin Jr. Look, Jay, you, you you giving up stuff, bro. They even, I didn't even know the baby name was AJ. You giving up stuff, Jay. You talking too early. They ain't got no formula, no nothing. Wait, maybe, oh, they got titty milk. Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Ain't no white man, baby. <laughs> I'm fine. Oh, I'm fine. Don't die, Rebecca. I just wish I could get warm. Slim, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Do you? Want to hold him? 
Oh, it ain't my damn baby. Shit. No, I don't that. think I should. It's really okay. We're family. Yeah, that's okay. Thanks. What's the matter, Clementine? You don't like babies? She doesn't have to hold him if she doesn't want to. Fair enough. Here, let me take him. You both should rest. Especially you. You about to fuck around and die. Slept, Kenny. How about two years ago? I'm fine. <laughs> Plus, somebody's got to watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. She gonna, she gonna fuck around. He gonna fuck around. Marry Rebecca next, like, bro, Dan, you got holes. Kenny, Kenny got holes. Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. <laughs> go. Go where? Just away, okay? You know, Jamie, Sarah. I'm not going to stick around and watch it happen to you too. You know the score. But I thought you believed in me. I do. Man, Kenny got all the brr. And everyone's luck runs out. Kenny got all the brr. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. I owe these people everything. They've kept me safe, looked out for me. I wouldn't be here without them. Well, they can't keep you safe forever. No one is safe forever. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Oh, hell yeah, I'm gonna take the nail fan. I ain't gonna refuse nothing. Thanks. Yeah. Man, I want to be like Kenny when I grow up. I gotta go. The girlfriend left. You saw it. Hey, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? I'm fine. Okay, good. <laughs> Hell of a night, though. <sighs> the temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while, you know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore, see if we can find some place to scavenge. Well, you just wanna smash in here. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Daughter? Damn it! That was some good pussy! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit. Childish. God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two can roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. Kenny's just trying to protect the group. Then I look. Nah, Luke, you was on bullshit. I'm you sorry. fucking when we trying to help. Uh, help. Fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer. And Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you. Okay, everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. 
Kenny got all the best shots. He know everything. It might be a good stop on the way. Kenny. <sighs> I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. Whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa. What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days at, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And it won't help the rest of us. And what about shelter? We'll freeze out. Rebecca do need the rest, though. That's right. She needs to rest. <laughs> we should wait a few days. Maybe that's for the best. We don't want to push Rebecca too hard. Just give me a day or two, Kenny. I'll be fine. This is a mistake. But we should all try to get some sleep. I thought you cared, Kenny. I don't know. Alvo probably gonna fuck around. <laughs> Hi, Bex. <laughs> Big Bex on the tracks. <laughs> Big Bex on the tracks. Big Bex on the tracks. Big Bex. Big Bex. Big Bex. Big Bex. Big Bex. Big Bex. On the tracks. On the Okay, quick. Cool. It ain't shit. I ain't talking about C. Kenny's the best. I told you. Like, he was trying to leave Rebecca. Like we said, oh yeah, she needs to chill. He said, no, we need to leave now. <laughs> Kenny's an <laughs> asshole. But look, Rebecca can't even walk. She's exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. <laughs> Clean your uh, gauze, boy. Yo, I'm about to get infected. We should have left right away instead of waiting around. We could have found more food and been someplace warm days ago. We did the right thing. She was in no condition to move. She's worse now. We can still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. You're not helping anything by arguing. Well, don't forget you agreed with me about waiting to leave camp until today. Uh, well, maybe I shouldn't have, bitch. Fuck. She got the baby. It's a place to sit. Rebecca, let me take the baby. <sighs> Rest for a minute. I'll wash her. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being Shh. weird about it. Yeah, you kinda have been. And not just right now. He's not your baby. I was just trying to help. Hello? What is this? That's Alvo? Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. We robbed him. That's the guy? You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. I don't trust him. Also, he might be mad at us. Everybody we, keep we your robbed eyes open. here friend you got people with you where are they you're not out here on your own are you I know it these are my friends we stay hidden for safety but you we know you're Clementine Etani? Da. Etani. <laughs> Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол и что вы забираете <laughs> Откуда я знаю, чтобы... We don't want any trouble. 
I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What the hell? Why get excited? No, you aren't taking anything from us. They're not telling me to ask. So what is Josh? I wish we could have met differently, Clementine. But this is how it has to be. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass! Слушай, Арфа, почему они не... We have a baby! You have a baby with you? У них родничковый ребенок! Если ты знаешь, что хорошо для тебя, просто не оружие сейчас! Их слишком много! Бурико, отойди! Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it! I'll do you. it! No, don't it. even try it, motherfucker! Don't fucking I guarantee don't move. I'm a better shot than move. you are. I'll drop you both before you can blink. Everybody be cool! <laughs> this doesn't have to go hey, down like that! Can he be tripping? Oh, she died? Rebecca! She was turning. Oh, maybe I should have shot Rebecca. <laughs> Damn! Somebody got lit up. Oh man, that was dang. You went fifty nine percent of place on so most people left Sarah. Dang. Alright you guys, that was The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 4. So tomorrow we're going to play Episode 5. So if you guys enjoyed this, please, please, please like, share, subscribe, do a, leave a comment, do anything, show the channel some love. But I will see you guys in the next one.